This guy right here, I'd like to blow. Well, that's what we do on the Gay Boy Show. We haven't done that yet. That's like episode, like, 100. Yeah, dude. If episode we hit, 100 if we, if we hit 100 subscribers, I'll blow this guy live on camera. Just ever or, like, soon? Like, no, if we ever hit 100, 100, 100 subscribers special. Dude. This is when I drink your cum. <laughs> going in the video. <laughs> All right. Okay. Well, uh, uh, let's save that surprise for last. Right, you're right. Uh, you can go first this time. Yeah, this one is a uh, pear edition Red Bull. Stick into the energy drink now, theme. Now, classic uh, got, Alden here, trying all the all the different flavors of Red I've Bull. I've tried every lines. single other ev- individual Red Bull flavor, but the pear edition I've never even seen before, and it sounds kind of bad. This pear flavor just ten- generally tends to not be good. See right. Jelly Bellies. Um, jelly crack. Belly Pears are okay. Jelly Belly Pears are like... Okay, whatever. Anyway. <laughs> what, wait, what are we looking on this packaging? Anything interesting? It's sugar-free. Uh-huh. Crisp it is pear. crisp pear. Artificially. Artificially flavored. There's no pears involved and in, no pears were harmed in the making, in the making of, this of this. pear juice. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and the serving size is one can, if you were curious. It's appreciated worldwide by top athletes. All right. Specifically this flavor. I mean, it smells like juicy pear jelly belly. I think it smells a little real perrier than that. Perrier? Yeah. Boston perrier. Wait, perrier. Uh, Wait, do we have... Perrier? Oh, dude, you... You're, throwback! You're, you're breaking the fourth wall and showing that we're doing these all on the same fucking day. <laughs> all right. Downing. That's good. I was thinking... I'm, it smells like it's going to be good. That tastes like pear. Yeah, it's good. It's got, like, the classic energy drink tang, but pear kind of has that. Yeah, it's a little bit off pear. A little bit towards <laughs> mango. Almost. A little bit towards mango, but otherwise, like, good pear. That's good pear flavor. It's good pear flavor. Yeah, on, the, on the scale of pear drinks I've had, that's got to oh, yeah. be very high. Because like, most pear drinks do it terribly. Yeah. Terribly. Nice. This one's good. I give this one a 7.5. Yeah, I go for a 7.58. I don't generally drink, like, full energy drinks, but, like, yeah, it's good. It's good. Cool. All right. It's good. Uh, what are we at? We're at 224. Perfect 224. timing. Oh. All right. So we're looking at a, look, look at this, look at this, look at this <laughs> look monster at this of a bottle. Curious packaging. This is a Argo tea. Is that, tea? Cl- is that clamshell wrapped? Or is it, it's got, like, a tear away. Yeah, it's got, like, a, oh, the full, like, thing tears away. Yeah, you have anyway. to imagine they did that because the cap doesn't stay closed otherwise, <laughs> right? Why else would they waste that much plastic? Loose leaf brewed, subtly sweetened. Subtly We're going to test sweetened. that on this show. Argo tea, tea plus ingredients with purpose. Show the camera. Very show the close camera. Up. There, there you go, there you go. Tea plus ingredients tea, with purpose. Tea with a purpose. Tea with a purpose. What is the purpose of this so tea? this is hibiscus tea sangria. It's all natural, smart calories, real ingredients. But what's the purpose? Sounds like you're just saying buzzwords here, buddy. Enjoy shaken and chilled. Well, I'm going to do one of those things. It contains 3% juice. Is the other 97% tea or are you lying to me? We got crisp apple, medley of berries and oranges. They don't want to tell me what berries. <laughs> <laughs> and thirst quenching hibiscus tea. Well, let's it's see mulberry. how it goes. Mulberry. All right. <laughs> Open it up. If, yeah, if, if, if the packaging doesn't oh, create litter all over like the This smells like your house. <laughs> what? That's what my house smells like? I think that smells like the Martin's, like, car- <laughs> carpet department. <laughs> it smells like a carpet. This is what your house smells like. I'm concerned. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> no, I think it smells like a shitty department store. It's a little bit stronger than your house. <laughs> All right. no, no offense taken. Does it taste like my house? Unpleasant. Bad. Tastes a little bit like a carpet department. We're going to try it. Argo. Short for Jason and the Argonauts. Let's Argo. On the Gay Boy Show. <laughs> oh, we missed it. We missed the opportunity. All right, that's next time. <laughs> yeah, do it on the next one for anybody who watches multiple. I took like a little sippy, and with a little sippy, I just got no flavor. It was just like flint water. <laughs> It's bad. Take a bigger sippy. <laughs> Snort it. It's bad. It's not good. Would not drink. Emerson would really like this, but only because of all the buzzwords. Yeah. I'm just like, where did the berries and orange go? I don't know. Is that what hibiscus tea smells like? Does that taste like? And there's apple in there? They just took oh. these things and just put them in there and then took them back out. <laughs> <laughs> it's no flavor. <laughs> <laughs> I just 
steeped with whole apples. <laughs> Just yeah. drop an apple in, like, that's good. That is pretty terrible. That is bad. I'm giving that a 2. 2? Oh, 1.5. 1.5. But the, the, the one that was really bad was a 1.5. Prune juice is a 1.5. Okay, yeah, this is less offensive than prune juice, I suppose. Yeah. Like, I, I could drink this. If this, like... Like, if this was, like... This was really good for you, which it might be. I don't give a shit, but... <laughs> I mean, if I was a de- in the desert, and I was given, like... Yes. Like, a drinking fountain that only dispensed this... It'd be, like, okay. It'd be, like, okay. If I had a drinking fountain that only dispensed prune juice, I would... I would s- die. I, I would die of shitting myself. Oh, right. But I don't also, know that i drink the prune yeah, juice. Yeah, I wouldn't drink enough prune juice to even shit myself. Alright, anyway. Anyway, I'm I'm done. I'm, I, don't, I don't want this anymore. Yeah, that just, that that good, just put me in a bad mood. Bad way to end the day. Shameful. See you later. Fuck you. Them? Yeah. Fuck you. No. (laughs) That's what we do. (laughs) It's gay boy away. Today we're going to review, um... Ribena, mango, and lime. A weird flavor combination. Mango, lime. It's got less than 15 calories, though. If you don't know, Ribena's a juice in the UK. Juicy since 1938. The normal flavor is called black currant, which is just a fancy word for shitty grape juice. This has got um, real fruit sugar, no added sugars. Real fruit juice, no added sugars. No artificial colors, no artificial flavors. Um, keep active, eat healthy, enjoy Ribena. Oh my god. This is mango juice, but it's shitty mango juice. Weak as fuck. What's. Where's the fucking lime? I bought this because I liked limes. See, I don't know why you would get this. It's it's weak. You don't even get the mango taste until afterwards. Who who wants this? And like, look at like over half the branding is like limes, and there's no limes. There's no limes anywhere. It's not. It's. It's, it's gonna be a five from me. Yeah. See you next time.